So um, we put some pictures up uh, last night of Matthew Perry hours before he tragically died. Less than 24 hours, really. And the story we're about to tell you underscores what we have said from the beginning, which is that we heard from a lot of people. He was in a very good place mentally, physically, um, and he was living his life and the trajectory was upward. Right, and the uh, young lady who was sitting at the table with him at the Hotel Bel Air uh, on the day before, on Friday afternoon, around 2, 2.30, um, they had, from all reports from people who were there, that uh, there was a very intense, not intense, but engaged conversation, that Matthew really wasn't paying any attention to his food or drink and was having this conversation with a woman who we didn't realize who it was until after we posted the photo. Um, and then she actually spoke out about that final meal, that final date uh, that Matt had uh, with, her name is Athena Crosby. She is a 25-year-old model and entertainment reporter here in town. Um, and this is what she had to say about that day. She said, I'm so devastated from his death, but felt it was in poor taste to talk about it publicly as the attention should not be on me, but rather on him and his legacy. But indeed, we were friends, and I was one of the last people to speak to him and see him before he passed. I want to emphasize that Matthew was in extremely good spirits and talked to me enthusiastically about the things he had coming up in his life. He was so happy and vibrant. Please refrain from any speculation surrounding his death and know that the man was on a comeback and truly deserved more time on this earth. So we told you about... Um the fact that he had already signed on to a movie um, in which he drama. was going to star. It was going to be a drama that he had several uh, TV projects, um, episodic projects for series, actually, um, that he was working on. And that aligns with everything yeah. that we were told.